Hi everybody, I'm Rochelle, the mother of the mother-daughter owners of Godiva Secret Wigs. And I am meeting a beautiful woman and her mother. Can you yell, Mom? Hi. Hi. <laughs> That's Linda. You'll see her in a minute. I might get you to poke your head in. But um, the beautiful Chrissy. Hello. Nice to meet you all. My goodness. So what a delight for me <laughs> to have you in my chair. We've never met. I saw a, two pictures you sent me. And so we are going to talk about pieces on this video. So how'd you find me? Um, through Eileen at Eileen's Boutique. Okay. All right. So we both love shopping at Eileen's Boutique, I've got to say, in Westlake Village. And so you heard a little about me. Okay. So I'm going to jump right in because you keep your hair pretty much this light blonde. Correct. Okay. So our pieces are not human hair, so you can't dye them. Um, so for pieces, I want to get really close. Let me show you what I'm wearing. Sounds perfect. Okay. So my hair's just clipped back here. And I'm wearing a wavy top piece. Four clips. And you just lift it up and lower it back. So this is me. Oh, fun. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. <laughs> so I have a high forehead. My hair is receding on the sides. And we do many different pieces. This is my wavy top. And all I do is just flip it over. Flip it like a pancake over right at my hairline. Mm -hmm. And it's got two metal clips. I snap it in work around my face first so it already kind of makes sense and then if I like the front I clip it in the back and I get that extra fullness that I like so that is wavy top this is a machine tease piece because I like if you know me you know me I like fullness but many clients want a flatter see-through scalp so we're going to try a few different top pieces on Chrissy See what you like, let us know. Tell me the truth, tell me the truth, okay? So I'm gonna start off with what I think is super close to you. Oh, hair. that is really close. Ta-da! <laughs> and this has bangs. Okay. So this is our Taylor Top in Champagne. Many of you, you already know it, you love it. For those of you that don't, four clips, and they just rock open and close and they have little rubber grippers underneath. And so you just put it on like I did. So let me show you. So I'm just gonna leave your hair. I open the clips. And so this is, there's no hard part to top pieces. It's just getting it in the right place. So I wanna bring those veins down longer, right? Mm -hmm. But once you know where you want it, if you like a top piece, they're amazing. Looking for your forehead. Okay, I'm gonna get it down lower. There we go. So, is that pulling on you at all? No, it's not pulling. Okay. So remember, I've only put it on you just now, but play with it a minute and connect with it. Because some people, they'll put a top piece on or a wig pop it on, go impatient, expecting it to be perfection in a minute, and then they take it off, it's not for me. But this is about connecting with the piece, the color. The color works. The color, I couldn't get closer to you, right? Perfect. <laughs> so, Especially for a synthetic, I haven't been able to find synthetic in my color. Well, you haven't met us yet. <laughs> Because Champagne R is this color, one of our most popular colors in wigs, I have for you, and in pieces too. So we play left and right, it's machine tees. Now I've seen you in a wig, you like fullness, right? I do like fullness. So if you want a little more fullness, this is machine tees on top. The best way to get some easy fullness and just start playing is change the part. So what does it mean by machine teased on top? Machine teased is the whole top has little naughty little hairs that you don't see 
unless you try and make a machine teased flat piece flat. So look, I'm machine teased here. Right. So if I'm wearing it like this, it doesn't look right. No. Do you see this? So I hope you can see. The goal of machine teasing, the beauty of a machine teased piece, is you can get as much lift as you want. So I could tease this baby down at the scalp. I haven't clipped the back, so it's not secure yet. But it's just a very natural height for a natural amount of hair. So a lot of women that don't have a lot of hair, you're not used to that little extra airiness of hair at the top. You're used to your thin, thinner, finer hair laying flat. But that's not what machine teasing is about because don't we all want a little height, right? Yes. So yeah, I like what you did right there. And so now I'm going to clip the back. Mama Mia, okay? I'm gonna put the tag in so you can really see. And I'm gonna show you the back too. She just asked me if it's too much, and it's just so funny when you're not. Ask me! No, <laughs> ask her. <laughs> ask mom. But it always happens that if you don't have a lot of hair, you're not used to it, and you think it's too much, but it's not. Right. It's not at all. Right. Yeah, I was just wondering this the bang on this part. And I can thin it. Okay. I can open it up and make it airier. Okay. I can get in there with thinning shears like you can, or you can go to any hairdresser. Or if you have a hairdresser you love, I don't need to do it. Have her do it. But I, I've been doing it for forty years. I know what I'm doing and I'm I have I'm fearless with these pieces. <laughs> and maybe, but you're not used to it yet. Right. Okay. So we, after seeing ourselves for decades looking one way, it's so easy to make anything else wrong. So the main thing is look different, be different, not wrong. Okay. And a lot of clients, and I know you know, when you start wearing it, it takes some courage that very first day. That's why I say go in a mall, go run errands, do whatever. And you'll see no one is pointing you out. No one is going <laughs> up to you. Is that your hair? You can't, you can't tell. Right. So I'm gonna spin you around so everyone can see. And mind you, I haven't taken a brush to this. I've done nothing. So look, Linda. It looks great. It really looks great. So I just wanna show everybody and then I'll show you Chrissy. Here, the piece is very thin in the back because mainly what we want is the height at the top. So here's Chrissy's hair, pretty blunt cut and all I would do if you keep your hair this length is just barely nip these little tails. See, just that little bit. That's all you need to do. So I want to show you the back because I'm going to blow your mind. <laughs> oh yeah, that's perfect. Yes. So like I was showing everybody, Chrissy, this is the piece. Okay. The rest is your hair. So it's not, we don't Actually, we're working on some thicker pieces in the back for women that have almost no hair. Okay. But they don't want to wear a wig. So, but this is just the best way because you're getting that little height, little thicker bang. So, let's see. Hold that for me a minute, will you? So, just to show you some different things. Do you wear your hair ever behind your ears? Yes. Okay. So let's just look at the options for any top piece. So you can just look. It's Easy. Fun. Very or fun. I can take the top and just pull it back and clip it. And I don't mean top the top piece. I just mean grab some hair. And for me, I never go for a perfect look because that looks wiggy. <laughs> so let me just show everybody really quick. And I'm doing it quick. I'm not sending Chrissy out right now, but this is for you to start seeing what's possible. Now with synthetic pieces, I know if I wear my hair back and it's my natural hair, it'll leave like a crinkle in my hair. Does that happen with 
the synthetic pieces? Uh, only if you make a pony, well, not even, if you put your hair in a ponytail all day, no. Okay. If, if you make a ponytail with a wig and you leave that elastic in there for months and you don't pull it out, then it will. I can't tell you what it will do. Okay. But to me, I do whatever I want. I braid my hair. I put it, I will not clip the two back pieces and then I will put my hair super high up in a, a pony or a bun. Okay. Because unclipping those let me lift it up even higher. Right. And so, no, none of that will make a crimp. And okay. we do sell the best item. You never use heat, blow dryers, curling irons, but this is our hot air brush. It's fantastic for smoothing out okay. or giving a little more lift, but really not necessary. So I want to show I think it's something else. So we can easily, of course, make a pony right here. Or I can twist, like many of you already know what I'm going to do. I twist low, mixing Chrissy's hair with the piece, and then I'm just twisting it up. And she could hide these pieces and turn it into a chignon. So look, Linda. Yeah, very classy. And the match is what I'm really I have a really critical eye about, but look, look at that. So we all have different colors in our hair. So, but this is phenomenal for you. I want you to see this, I've got to clip it. Oh, fun. Now, perfect. look at the color, okay? The color is spot on. Yes, and you could pull a few little pieces down, you know, make a little mess because that's what looks far. Even leave a few pieces in the back okay. falling. So, wonderful. It's nice having that extra bang, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> the little extra bang. I know for me, I have the same high forehead that you do. I have a, a really high forehead. And so I love my tailor top, but like a lot of clients, I own tailor top, I own a wavy top when my hair is wavy, I own tailor or other tops I'm going to put on you right now. And I like that it gives more coverage on the sides, because yeah. I know this is where I'm starting to thin out. Exactly. It's the temple. And me too, getting high right here. So uh -huh. even this little curl, these little pieces mean so much. Right. Just all about the illusion. And so we only carry high quality synthetic. This is not just any synthetic fiber. Okay. And this is why our clients love owning two to 20, 30, and 40 and more of our wigs and pieces. They have hair wardrobes. So it makes it fun because you can wake up in the morning and think, who do I want to be? <laughs> and I know many of you out there, you don't even choose your outfits first. You okay. choose the hair you're in the mood for, and then you go from there. So, and the fun, I just want to show you really quick. Dude, I know I have a pony in here. Hold on, I'm running. Hold there. one day, one way, you, you don't realize all the options and the freedom that you have. So, I need to show you this. Because that's all I did with my hair. That's all I have to do. Okay? I put a bun down low. So up at my hairline, even the tabs. And it's a whole new you. It's so cute. Right? It's adorable. Isn't it great? <laughs> this is freedom. I know most of you know this. And this is in Moonlight R with the roots. Pretty. So it's just once you get into this and you start playing, it's so fun and empowering. And it just builds confidence. So I had to show you my my sweet little, my new look, you know, because then I know many clients like me, we have glasses, we have different styles. 
So this might not be me every day, but sometimes it is. So let's move on. So that was Taylor in Champagne. Now I want to show you, well, let's just look at Taylor in Creamy Toffee, just so you can see a little different color on yourself. A little warmer. A little warmer. So just because a woman comes into me a color, um, because it's scary to color your hair a different color, but I am this color, creamy toffee. Okay. I have my hair dyed to match because I can't match a billion women's different hair color all over the world. So what women do, they find a color they love, take it to the hairdresser and say, please make me this color instead of talking about it. Well, the nice thing is with the bangs cut in and the different color, it blends still a lot easier than if it didn't have that. Exactly, exactly. So with a top piece, you're not seeing anything of you except the very bottom. And many women have their hair dyed lighter on the bottom. I have my hair dyed darker on the bottom. And so let's just turn your hair, do a little up sweep just to see because this color is great on you. So do you see now the blonde looks like a highlight? Yeah, it does. But it still works. So I'm gonna clip this just so you can see, Chrissy. Isn't that pretty? Oh, that is pretty. But see what you mean, how it looks it, like highlights. Right, that's all. Yeah. So that's as easy <laughs> as it is. So, you know, some women and new clients are not freaking out, but they're very nervous. Of course, the first purchase, it's scary to choose something, but Danielle puts light over her dark hair. I mean, we mix it up because women are doing all kinds of stuff. So anyway, that is also tailor top. I like the bangs on this one better. Okay, it's the same piece. I know, it's the exact same piece. Isn't that funny? <laughs> and also, your lighter is coming right through with the deeper. So you said highlight effect. Yeah, so the truth is you can do both colors. Okay. And when you take a top piece off, you unclip it and just lift it back and lower it down. Did it pull anything? Not at all. Not, Not a thing. Yeah, so that's, that's the way. And like anything, it's learning something new. So I want to try a, this is our long top in gold blonde. Oh, the color works too. Right, <laughs> right. right. So the only difference is it doesn't already have a bang. It's a little bit longer. But any wig or piece can be cut. But look, match is exact yeah, on the front. <laughs> That's perfect. Okay. This is a little more fringy cut. Bangs could easily be trimmed right to add right in with your hair. I love the length on this. So would you grow your hair? Um, I would grow my hair. The, my problem is, is when I grow my hair, I start to get too weighted down and then it makes it feel even thinner. Okay. Um, but okay. to blend it in, and I like the way that this is cut and tapered in the front. Mm -hmm. So I want to show you because although you like the length, because you are blunt cut in the back, I wouldn't let you do this. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so because it, it doesn't look natural anymore, and let me show you why. Oh, I see what you're talking about. Okay. It gets too stringy. Because our top pieces are thin, not meant to really thicken you up. And if you move your head around the I'm piece, gonna it. I'm going to see your blunt cut underneath there. Okay. So all we would do is just trim, just trim it right up there. And now, you, if she's like that length, do you have a wig that's in this? Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna get there. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna blow your mind on another video, which we're doing right now. 
but you'll see on a future video of wigs, you're going to blow your mind and I'm going to blow your mind. I already know. <laughs> so, but the fun thing with this wig, even, I mean, top piece, even keeping it long, is you can put it up, clip it, and you get all this extra. Say you're yeah, going right. somewhere dressy, and uh, it's just phenomenal to have that little extra hair. Or you make a pony, or you make a side pony. When the hair is all mixed in together, you're not going to see the difference. Right, right, right. Okay. Or braid it. So I could braid it. No, what color was this one? This is, I am forgetting. This is gold blonde. It's amazing, the three different ones. Right. It works really well. I just love that I'm finding synthetic toppers in my color because <laughs> nobody has synthetic toppers in my mart. <laughs> yes, they do. <laughs> it's a miracle. <laughs> Sorry, I need some electrolytes really quick, so. So, yes, phenomenal. Yes, it is. Love it. And now you're starting to see why one is barely scratching the surface of wigs or pieces. But you have <laughs> options. And even if you don't have a hair challenges, still, I mean, for me, I have tons of hair. I have a frizzy, crazy head of hair. But there's a lot of women in me. I want to look different. I enjoy experiencing all of those. And are you married? I'm not. Okay. Okay. So me too. <laughs> so men, there are great, and I know you'll talk about your hubbies because many men actually they love it that their wife is experiencing different things. It's giving her something new and different instead of the same old and new and different for him. Spiced enough to life. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Exactly. So this is long top. And this color, once again, gold blonde. So do you want to just remove those two clips, feel? You do one clip at a time, oh, or both. There you go. <laughs> That's how easy it is. That's great. Yeah. So I'm going to take you. And I know you like the fullness, so I want to show you. OK. This one now, we're going to blow your mind. So this is our 22 inch top in creamy toffee, the okay. same color. The same look, that, that bang, let me take it lower. So a top piece with bangs, it's so easy to know where to put it, just match it to your bangs, right? Mm -hmm. right. So, you can't wear it low. There are wigs I have for you that way. However, you can braid it. Nobody will know. Okay. So if you want that length and you don't want to wear a wig, you're just not in the mood. Right. So let, I'm just going to show you quickly. Let me show our audience how I do a braid. I'm just going to snap these in. Hide the price tag. So are we having fun yet? Yeah, this is great. It's pretty good, huh? It's awesome to see how she can just transform. So many options. So here's Chrissy's hair. Here's the piece. So all I'm doing, is just like you would braid your own hair, I'm taking her hair with the top piece and I'm just braiding it right in and when I get to her hair I'm kind of twisting to make sure that her hair is getting kind of sucked right in to the braid and her little ends are not sticking out and the colors are fun because you'll see this is that's you wild so, of course, I don't have another ponytail, but I want you to see, and I'm going to show you. Oh, let me turn you around again. I'm just going to lay it right there, and you'll get a little idea. Oh, fun. It does blend right in. It does blend right in, and you could always bring that up and clip it, 
and have some hair coming out. I mean, you can do many different things with so it. So does this one in the back look the same as the other one did, where you can really see my blood cut through it? If you wear it down, oh. yes. Let me show you. Yeah, and I wouldn't let you do it. <laughs> Won't let you do that. Okay, I see. Okay, but Danielle and I, at this moment, we're designing something that will be as great in the front with thicker hair in the back. Okay. And I know I'd add you to the list. And there's <laughs> for sure. Many clients that are waiting for us. It will be a topper, but, but thicker? It'll be a topper, but thicker hair. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Almost like we would call it not a three-quarter wig, but it will require the top to be a little longer oh. in the back mm -hmm. for that extra hair. Yeah. Because something's got to change. Mm -hmm. but, but yes. But if you've got a pony, I mean, it, it will work. It's just about hiding. Right. So that's our 22 inch. I do like the length. <laughs> it's well, fun to have hair, isn't it? When we have such thin, fine hair. It's really fun. It's so freeing because there's options. There's great so, options. Yes. So the other piece I want to show you that I have it in many clients out there, if you're saying, I have fine hair up here, I don't want that lift, I want something flat. This is our monofilament see-through scalp. Can you see this? I think you can. Yes. So every hair is put in a monofilament hair by hair. There's no, here's the difference between a machine tease top and a monofilament top, hair by hair, machine teased. And it's dark under here because this color has roots, so we like it to look natural. So this is our mono long top. This is another color, spring honey. So it goes on exactly the same, but you'll see that it's flatter. Flatter, thinner. So you cannot tease it and, and put your hands, just feel this. It feels like there's nothing on. It feels like there's nothing on, right. It does feel thinner here though. It is thinner because it has to be because the it's, there's not as much hair at the crown in, in the crown itself. Okay. So it's just for that little extra. I like the other ones better. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, very good. I just want to show everybody. So this is a mono long top. It's exact in length and things to the long top. But if you want a flat look, mono, mono wigs, mono tops. And by the way, if you have shorter hair or other colors, we do very short uh, to the longest is the 22 inches, but curlier, wavier. Check us out, godivasecretwigs.com. So let's see, of those three, if you just had to choose one for me to put on your head right now, the first one? Uh, let's try the first one again. Let's try the first. Okay. Why don't you do it? So before you even clip the back, right, make sure those bangs are as long as you want them. And if they're not, just do it again. I have to play while you're playing. <laughs> <laughs> playing is the fun part. It is. I can't believe how it blends so seamlessly. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool. It's amazing. So reach back here and clip those two, two back pieces in. And so if you've just purchased a new top piece and you get it home, 
is there, there's a little learning curve to learning where you clip the pieces in. And we have many videos about how to do it out of our over 550 videos on our Godiva Secret Wigs YouTube channel. So make sure you subscribe because we also put a video out every Monday, Danny and Rose Monday morning video. <laughs> That's cute. So, great. So I wanted you to see and have the confidence that you can do it. Oh, it's so easy. Right, it's no big deal. So thank you so much. And thank you, Linda, for being here. Thank you for having me. My pleasure. <laughs> and we will see you again soon because we're not done yet, okay? Talk to you soon. Bye. Bye. Hi, everyone. So Chrissy has decided to go with long top in gold blonde. She also was loving Taylor and champagne. We're talking just about top pieces right now. So I'm going to trim a little more bang and trim the length and I thought you might want to see what I do. So let's start around the face. So Chrissy has her bangs right there. Yes, that's yes, you. That's <laughs> me. So it's really easy because I trim longer than her bang first and then I'm just bringing it right up. So, always on the diagonal. Sometimes the hair will pop up a little bit, so you don't wanna pull it down when you're trimming it, because it'll pop up and sometimes be shorter than you really want it. So, it's mainly about getting the hair out of your eyes So I'm just creeping up to Chrissy's hairline, to Chrissy's bang. See how it's starting already to make a little sense there? in your eyes. Just taking it right up. I'm going to leave that longer for a little moment. you okay that is you so your hair is in your eyes yes it is i'm due oh. for a bang trim <laughs> oh, okay okay all right so if i nip a touch of your that's bang, totally are you okay yes. all right okay So most of what I'm doing is just little hairs, just to make sure, because it hurts your eyes. These fibers are amazing for hair, but you don't want them in your eyes. So I like to trim bangs so it looks like you almost need a haircut. That's perfect. Yeah. And then you can always just nip it just a touch. Is this in your eye right here? Yes. Yes or no? No, it's okay, actually. All right, I've got two little hairs in. Okay. Looks good. Pretty great, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so now, as you can see, Chrissy's hair is blunt cut shorter right here. So before I'm going to trim, I'm just going to make sure all the hair is where it's going to fall. And 
just start on the side. So here's Chrissy's hair. So I'm just going to make the piece match her hair. I'm not pulling, I'm just placing it together. see as you wear it you might decide okay I want a little bit more you know or I want it a little layered you could always take it to your hairdresser and have it layered too okay but I am just using her hair as you've seen on other videos as a guide to getting it her length So a, a wig or a hairpiece cut, it's not, I don't believe it's a precision cut. It doesn't need to be because the hair is not going to change. It's always, long top is always going to look like this. Whether you brush it, uh, wash it or, you know, whatever you do, this is how it's going to be. So I, my goal is to make the illusion work. So right now I'm just getting rid of some of this longer hair. It's much longer than her hair. So just want to get it out of here. So pretty. So if you're cutting it for somebody, is it better for them to cut it closer to their next hair appointment so that they trim it, it's on the longer side? Or do you trim it just to... Trim the... Uh, if you're going to let it... Well, you need to communicate that first before you take the scissors. Like, And that's why I asked you... Are well, you no, letting... I have a hair appointment on Thursday. So okay. trimming okay. it now is perfect because this is the longest my hair would be. Love it. Um, so that's great. So if they take a little bit off of my hair at the appointment, this will still be okay? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely. And worst case scenario, they'll trim a little bit more. Okay. I mean, if you find... But it, it's going to be so close. I mean, unless blend. you're having two inches or... No, not at um, all. And, but the fact, when your hair is blunt cut like yours, the length shows up much more versus somebody who has layered hair. Okay. And their, you know, some of their hair is longer, but if it's layered, it doesn't show up as much. But look what's happening so far. That's right. You see that? So. But you have to have the patience of a saint. I can't believe how <laughs> you. <laughs> you. Oh, no. I want you to see what we've got so far. Look. Oh, wow. Okay. So you can see what hasn't been cut. Right. And now it just blends right in there. It does. It's perfect. Isn't that great? Thank you. Sure. I love trimming. It's, it's fun. It's creative. And, um... I was watching with those bangs of that. Oh my gosh, you're so patient where you're just so intricate. It's just what's what's necessary, <laughs> you know. No, this is amazing. This is just, do you all see this, how great this is? Love it, love it, love it, love it. 
And it seemed like taking some of the length off makes it appear even a little thicker. Mm -hmm. Yes. Less, less weight on it. Yes. And you won't have those little thinner ends. So it does appear thicker. And, and I am going barely, like you won't even notice, a touch longer than your hair. But it works in beautifully. So even if you go a little shorter, it's still going to look great. And remember, and this is the top. Right. So I'm always trimming on the diagonal, never straight across. Because then it helps the hair just to look more natural. And then as you wear it, remember it's a new piece, it has no memory. But all of our pieces have what we call memory curl. So as you start wearing it, as it rests and molds to your head, as the hair relaxes, it just gets better and better, really. It's so fun. Even after 26 years, every, you know, every haircut, every style is just exciting and new. I guess it's the Gemini in me. What's the best way to store a copper? Just fold it in half okay. and lay it, lay Same it flat. Same as the wigs. Same as the wigs, mm -hmm. yeah. So here around the face, I got Real close to here. I'm going to round this piece down a little bit just to calm it down before I let you get off this chair. But also, I'm looking now and making sure it's even. So that's what you want to do. Even I'll many times trim my front, all the front of a piece or a wig myself, and that lets somebody else, or then I'll put it on a head and trim it. Is that your hair? Yes. I think so. Okay. <laughs> Good lordy. Yes. <laughs> so I'm going to just blow this a little bit. Oh, I've got a crooked name here. <laughs> connected together. And it could flip up. Remember, it's hair, just like your hair. So it's going to do a little bit of what you want, but it's, it's always going to look the same. So I'm just going to round in the back a little bit. So that's basically it. 
and um, what do you think? It looks fantastic. Thank you so much. A I'm, topper is just what I needed. Oh my gosh, it's great. And your little bang, this is perfect. perfect. It's perfect. And you can still tease it and wear it full if you want. Tease it up. Okay. So thank you all for watching. Have a great day. Bye, Bye. everybody. Bye.